Hey guys, um, so I wanted to try one more recipe today on the barista recipe maker um, because it's not one that comes as preset on the machine um, but I did see it on the Nespresso website that you could add it through the app or I might have been browsing the app and saw it there uh, the Cortado recipe um, Now we have made one of these with an Aeroccino in the past on the channel but I thought I'd give it a go with the barista recipe maker and see what kind of a froth level it gives um, On the app it said to use one shot of espresso now, the reason I like the Cortado is because it gives you a real kick of intensity. It's a nice, strong coffee, similar to a flat white in some ways, um, but a little bit different also. It, I think one was came from Australia in its origin, um, and one came from Spain. I think the flat white was from Australia, and this one might have been from Spain. Um, so we'll pour the coffee now. We've got two, sorry, we've got two shots of coffee here already. I'm going to do the milk now. I've put 100 mil in, but I don't think that's all going to fit into the glass because I've added two shots, whereas Nespresso said to add one. But I, I thoroughly recommend if you're doing a Cortado, personally, add two shots so you make it nice and intense. But it is funny, really, because I went into a coffee shop um, a couple of years ago now and they said, what, what, do you, what would you like to order? I said, well, what would you recommend? Because I, I love a flat white, but I, I want something that's a little bit different, but I want something really intense. And she said to me, Cortado, straight away. I think we mentioned this on the podcast in the past when we were doing that. Um, and I got this drink and it was absolutely beautiful. It was gorgeous, honestly. Um, so I should make more of them, really. I, I'm, a bit, I'm a bit of a latte drinker, but this, maybe if at this recipe, it should be nice and hot. From the barista recipe maker now that it's on there maybe i'll be making more cortados going forward because i really do like them maybe if you're an expert you could explain a couple of the differences between the flat white and the cortado i think the word cortado by the way it comes from is it spanish or italian i had a spanish or italian word for to cut which means that you cut through the espresso with the milk and that's where the word comes from Let's see, if we, get, if we could get away with um, using less milk, maybe the process would be a bit quicker as well. So I don't think all of this is going to fit in. Got this here so I can pour it nice and easy. There's lots more recipes on the channel, by the way. We've done lots more vi um, videos with the barista recipe maker, cappuccino, flat white and we even made a matcha latte in it and um, so if you want to check that out feel free we have playlists on the channel with the barista videos on as well so do check that out so let's pour this out now oh it does fit pretty much all the milk in so 100 ml of milk two shots of espresso it's left a nice little bit of a uh, my attempt at latte art on the top there, that's about as good as it gets for me at the moment. But that is, I know to drink that is gonna be a really nice, intense coffee. Um, it's certainly gonna be, a, give you a kick of caffeine. So do be careful though. Maybe have decaf if you've had too much caffeine already today. Um, but thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed that. Another little video with the barista recipe maker machine. Well, let's have a little taste, I can't resist. That is very, very nice. I love the Cortado. Yeah, so thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. And bye for now.